Last week, Tenacity partners, donors, and friends joined students and staff at the Longwood Cricket Club to participate in the fourth annual Tenacity Cup. We couldn't be more ready. And after last year's cancellation due to COVID, this year's teams were more than ready to go. Uh, we've got the best player with us right here. Okay, if everyone will report to the clubhouse for... Over 144 participants in all, including a number of elite players, as well as 24 Tenacity students were on hand for the day to reaffirm the great work Tenacity does to help kids along on their pathway to post-secondary success. The work that Tenacity is doing 6 to 12 is really um, important because of the, the impact it's having on our students. And we see it bear out in the data. 95% of the students who they serve are graduating from high school, and then 70% of those are going off and graduating from college. So that's life-changing for our students. It, it really, when we think about the impact of education and access and opportunity, they are hitting it right there. The CUP is designed to support the tenacity mission that leads to post-secondary success of over 800 public school-age children in Boston, as well as the Tenacity Summer Program that provides reading and tennis instruction to over 5,000 kids in Boston, Worcester, and Chelsea. And what are your names? Come on up here. This year we had an added treat as tennis great Chris Everett stopped by to say hi to the Tenacity students. Okay, I'm Chris. Nice to meet you. I used to be a pro a long time ago. One of the great things about Tenacity is the fact the statistics speak for themselves. I mean, it's wonderful to combine the tennis with the education, with the tutoring, you know, for these kids. And when I asked my father why he started All of Us Kids in Tennis, I expected his answer to be because I wanted you to win tournaments or I wanted you to travel the world. Instead, his answer was to keep you kids off the streets. And now, as I'm a mother of three kids, I understand 100% what he means about that because it's just a wonderful way for the kids to you know, spend their time after school. And again, it's, it's not only the tennis, but it's the education as well. And those two go hand in hand and are winners. After a brief shower and a midday break, all the Tenacity kids were able to get back out onto the grass courts of Longwood. And from there, the Cup's afternoon session resumed as 12 teams competed in 30 matches throughout the day. Ultimately, we raised upwards of $900,000 that will be used to support future Tenacity education programs, frontline staff and schools, and family engagement efforts not to mention our college prep programs and continued support for Tenacity students throughout their college careers. In the end, one team prevails, and we'd like to extend a hearty congratulations to this year's winner of the Tenacity Cup, the Crimson Aces, as well as to each of our 12 Cup captains and teams and our other finalist, Team Supreme Court. And on behalf of all of us here at Tenacity, we'd like to express our sincere thanks to the many hundreds of donors who supported the Cup this year and the Tenacity mission to turn students into scholars. <laughs>